I got a little carried away and I started my tomato seeds a little bit too early. Um, they're pretty much ready to where they could go outside right now, but weather isn't actually permitting that yet. And so I'm uh, giving them a little more room to grow, changing pots, and uh, I ran into something that uh, some people might have some issues with. I'm moving, moving these from that size pot to that size pot. It's a little, little, little bigger. And uh, I just wanted to show you a few things that I'm running into. Like that right there. Uh, some people might disagree with me, but I basically just cut that stuff off. Um, these are some growing boogers. Tomatoes love to grow. And um, I don't think a lot of roots, you know, that it's sitting on or that are pointing up is a, a good idea. And so I'll trim these boogers off. I mean, it, it don't got to be perfect. I just I'd rather cut them off than have them ripped out, torn, you know, damaged, and then left there. So we got that, and then let me get this out of here. There's the there's what I was talking about. Okay, this is what you call root bound. It's not real bad root bound, but the roots are wrapping around the inside of that pot. You see, and that's not good. See, because plants aren't the brightest things in the world. Well, they might be, but they just like to grow way too much. They're, they're real hardcore about growing. And um, they'll strangle themselves. You know, if they get that, that mode of moving their roots right there. And I typically just do this. Now, see, if you get plants at a nursery... trees or whatnot, you got to do this. You have to do this. Because if they're all wrapped around there, they'll, they'll end up choking themselves out. They ain't going to be a very happy tree, bush, plant, anything. And granted, uh, your vegetables are a little, you know, they, they only have one season to do what, all they're going to do, and so you want to shock them as little as possible, but uh, I really think it's best if they don't choke themselves. You know? Anyway, so there's that. Got just a little bit of soil in the bottom of that cup. That in there, just like that. Fill that with dirt and pack around that edge there so that it's all nice and snug. Then you just want to take and water these in real good. And get rid of the air pockets and make sure every every part of the plant gets uh, gets plenty of water. Do that twice. 